Hey Wastelanders, this is Gary. Sorry it's been a long time. I've been busy. Other things have gone on. I hurt my back. <laughs> I've been sick. A whole mix of stuff. And uh, I've been a little depressed too. So probably I'm going to do a video on this. I, I, I believe I already did a video on this. The, the Degnan... Degnan Rose, I believe that's what it's called. And, uh, yeah. I had a, this lined up for a, a five uh, knives video. And uh, about the time I got sick and hurt my back. So, yeah, my back is still killing me. I don't know what I do to it. But anyway. Well, so, I got some mail today. Uh, I got a lot of mail. So I'm going to open it up and see what I got with this uh, knife. This knife is uh, made uh, by Wee Knives. It doesn't say anywhere on there. But trust me, I think it was made by Wee Knives. It was made by for uh, Drop, Drop.com, who doesn't do knives anymore. But... I'm glad I picked it up. It's a full titanium with a nice micarta inlay. Nice micarta backspacer. This is the perfect gentleman's knife. I love everything about it. Anyway, I'll cover that in a future video. So I, I kind of know what this is because I recognize it. It's some stickers from... Uh, Zug Monster. So I wanted to try out their uh, chrome sticker. So everything that was white, and there was a lot of white in this logo, it's uh, like shiny chrome. I mean, the color stuff is shiny chrome too, but I love it. <laughs> I was out of this uh, particular sticker, and so I like, I saw a deal on, and I said, "Oh, what the hell?" I think it was like ten bucks plus shipping, I think, and for fifty stickers, and it's. I thought uh, I wanted to check it out. I saw Maddie's Madisfaction's uh, stickers in Chrome, and uh, I wanted to try some of my stickers in chrome anyway so there's some stickers in chrome I have 50 now I'll use them as giveaway stickers and I got two of these envelopes and I think this is from the same place let me see off camera it's it says from Post Falls Idaho I believe I drug out this uh, buck knife that I received without this uh, thumb studs. This is the Buck 12 Ranger. And I've went around and round. And I, I hope this is what I think it is. I hope this is the thumb studs in there. Because I went, I mean, I think it took two months to get the thumb studs. Hopefully they're in there. If they're not the thumb studs, I'll continue to go round and round with Buck. They were, uh, they weren't going to, they, they said, send me the knife and we'll attach the thumb studs. And then it was, I'll send you a thumb studs. And then I, it was, I'll send you a whole knife. And next time I contact them, they said, we're going to send the thumb studs. And that was like three emails. And hopefully, those are the thumb studs. Well, I hope this <laughs> the thumb studs. I hope. I hope. I hope. And if it does, it isn't thumb studs. I don't know what it is. God, I hope it's the thumb studs. Okay, it's thumb studs. But I believe it's not for. <laughs> I believe it's not for the knife. 
Uh, I believe this is, they were supposed to be black thumb studs. Like, let's see how they fit. <laughs> oh, God. Hopefully they fit. Let's see. Well, let's see. I have to read it. I think I have to squeeze the thumb, squeeze together the thumb studs. So, you know, it's a thumb stud, and I don't know if it'll work, but it's not the correct thumb stud that moves like crazy. Anyway, I'll probably have to go round and round with them again. Let's see what's in the other package. Okay. Oh. It's two thumb studs now, but this is the same one. I, I really don't get it because they're, it's not the black thumb studs. I mean, it's, it's okay, but uh, I don't know. I'll, I'll let you guys know what comes up with this. I've, gotten, I've grown quite fond of the knife sans thumb studs, but... I really would like the thumb studs for some reason. I think that would make it easier to open. Right now, I, I have to, I can't, I can't one hand it. I have to use two hands. So, it's not a biggie, but I bought it for the thumb studs. Let's get on with a two other knife, or I, I, I believe this is a knife. Uh, I got this knife. It's obviously from the same place and obviously from the same knife. There was a little mix-up. I ordered this uh, petrified fish knife that's in here. And lo and behold, uh, uh, friends of, friends of the, the channel and friends of mine, I talk to them all the time. Winchester and Manisfaction sent a knife to me, but I had already ordered the knife and I couldn't cancel it because it was, it said it was shipped. So I'll end up receiving the same knife as a gift, a gesture, and I bought the same knife. So I'll probably have to think of what to do with the extra Maybe I'll do, use it in a giveaway. Or maybe a donation. I don't know. To some other channel. Depends on how I feel. Alright. But this is a good looking knife. A good looking knife. If you ask me. I mean, I hope. I saw all the pictures and it re was really good looking to me and I was hoping uh, let's see how it, this is a new packaging that I think well not maybe it not I don't remember uh, them being taped up and like this okay sweet sweet there's a little bit of extra hardware cleaning cloth and this is the, I don't remember if it's, I don't remember what it's called. You'll probably have to see something in the description because there's no paperwork. I don't remember the model. Look down there on the screen and I'll, I'll show you, I'll describe the, I'll, I'll put that down on the, the screen. So let me try to open this up. All right. Okay, sweet. Let me. So this is the petrified fish something, unless it says it on the, the PFP03. 
it's in K110, I believe. <laughs> so, this is a, a, a green micarta. It's kind of weird because pictured in the, all the pictures I've seen on it, this uh, looks to be almost black, but it's clearly like a, a green micarta. I like it so far. This is weird, but the micarta extends past this uh, blade. I don't know how I feel about that. It's kind of like a. It's kind of weird, <laughs> but other than that, I, I kind of like it. It you can s clearly see the knife is a uh, swappable from left to right. It has a slot in both sides of the micarta. If you could see that so it's not a milled clip but it's at least it's different I, I think it's a probably a good clip definitely deep carry let's see let's see how deep carry it is yeah super deep carry I'll have to give you guys uh, when I do the review I'll have to tell how it goes in and out of the pocket quite snappy quite drop shutty what I, why I was drawn to the knife it was because it was like a really cool clip point and I was drawn to it by this uh, fuller in the blade I think this is a cool looking fuller it's obviously not left hand friendly you can uh, you can probably flick flick it out let's see oh you can flick it out with your middle finger and using the flipper tab you can flick it out I've, I've, I think it's a really nice knife. It's a beefy knife. Beefy knife. This is probably going to be a, a favorite carrier of mine. But I'll let you know in the future down the road when I carry it a while. I wish this uh, had a name. And maybe it does. I'll, if it does indeed have a name, I'll... Uh, put that on down on the screen besides the the model I number I read off it's weird that they include extra hardware but I'll take extra hardware if any time to use on other knives has a lanyard hole I don't know how I feel about this uh, a micarta extending I don't know it's, it's kind of weird <laughs> maybe it's just a look I would have been fine with uh, the Micarta just being smoothed off. But I'll try to darken this Micarta up too. I'll add some mineral oil to it and uh, hopefully it will darken up a little. I think it's partially dark everywhere except for this spot. But yeah. Great ergos feels comfortable in the hand. I, I I'm pretty sure I don't feel the clip at all. I don't even feel this uh, funky backspacer. Let's quickly open the other one just to make sure that it's the same construction and this is the same knife. It would be cool if I got the blue one too by accident, even though I didn't order it. And I'm pretty sure Winchester told me that he ordered the green one for me. So, yep, it's the same one. Yep. All right. It's. I just want to check that the backspacer too. Sorry if this is be a long video, but you know I haven't done video in a, about a week, so bear with me. I'll probably edit, edit some of this out. Nope, it's the same backspacer. It's just kind of weird. 
that it extends a little bit past there. I've never seen that before. Yeah. So I believe this is darker because they probably oiled the shit out of it inside there and that leaked from the pivot. So it probably is normally a lighter green, but if I add mineral oil to it, I can darken it up. That tells me. So same same snappy feeling. I, I believe it's K110. So K110, I believe is uh, D2. Man, really good action. Wow, really good action. Let's see. I have to practice getting my uh, middle finger in the right place. <laughs> I really like knives that you can uh, use the fuller to flick out. Hmm. Such a nice blade shape. I really am a big fan of clip points. Even though I don't order or order or own many clip points. Um, I, I'm hard to... I'm, I think this is a flat grind. At first I thought it was a hollow grind. I, I don't know if it's hollow grind or... I uh, forgive me, but it feels like a flat grind. Anyway, so yeah, I got two of these knives. So I'll let you go, Wastelanders. Take care.